welcome to my channel happy new year to everybody and thank you to all my new subscribers it's so great to have you I'm so happy this year I'm really really excited about 2018 I think it's gonna be a great year well I'm going to make it a great year and I hope you guys really do think positive thoughts with that said I wanted to bring fashion into the mix and to let you know or to encourage you to definitely start 2018 on the right foot yes so I wanted to share a couple of my boots that they don't give me a hard time at all these are boots that I absolutely swear by and I hope that by sharing these that you would find some inspiration as to what to look for when you're investing in certain boots or shoes and the comfort and not just the style that you're looking for. So I definitely hope you learned something from this video and I'll see you in the next one. So the first one I wanted to share with you is this over the knee boot by Sam Edelman and this boot has been in my wardrobe for over two or three years now and every single year I wear this at some event whether it's new year get together and it has really really stood the test of time because you know why this is a boot that has a little platform so whenever I step out whether it's for a Christmas event or a New Year event this boot definitely gives me the comfort level to go all evening long and look fabulous, chic and comfortable and that's what you look for in a boot so this is how I normally pair my Sam Edelman boot and maybe I'm mispronouncing that name, but anyway, long before Stuart Weisman, I had this boot. And as you can see, it's very similar to the make and style. It has the same lace detail, um, well, lace of detail at the back, and it stays put. Um, when I tie it snugly and tightly, it stays put, but I also like when it eases down a little and it gives me some room to move. I mostly wear these on New Year's Eve nights and also nights when I'm going out with the girls and we're gonna go dancing I look chic and I am so comfortable comfort level for this boot is on par or surpasses the Stuart Weisman boots so I would suggest that if anyone comes across this boot I have had it for ages now definitely invest in it I got it at Browns in Toronto so I'm sure that they're likely to bring it back because it was such a great boot so this is definitely a boot for 2018 that you can put your best foot forward which for me is my right foot absolutely proud of as well because it has you would notice a common trend with my boots they have like probably a little platform for comfort level because I love an elegant heel and in order for me to invest in these I need them to be comfortable and awesome so these definitely fit the bill again this is another boot that has been with me um, for over 
four or five years now I got this pair at Aldo and I loved it so much that I also have the black in it as well because it is an excellent professional boot as well as one that can transition well into the evening or to any other event that you may have so I definitely love it this is the gray and if you work in a creative environment this might work but definitely not suitable for a professional environment but I've just um, throw the skirt in just to show you what it looks like I'll normally pair it with a, a regular top that is very conservative and modest and this is the kind of top I would have in my bag just in case I'm going for drinks later on but yeah this is how I'll pair it and put in my best foot forward for 2018. <laughs> And this is what the black pair looks like and this definitely gives you a sense of how I pair it. I normally wear, would wear a coat or a jacket or a blazer similar to this one so it really gives a nice chic look and I just love it. So definitely one great boot or actually two great boots to start your year off with at work or of course in a social setting definitely ready for that girl boss meeting <laughs> been with me for over the years is this gorgeous piece by Guess Marciano and if you notice with this one this I invested for when I'm definitely hitting the pavements looking for jobs and it has really really served its purpose it's been around now for about eight nine years and what I love about this is the sleek elegance of the boot itself. It's, it's a good looking boot. I love this boot. I love the quilted details right here as well. It's so well designed that I just love all the features on top of it. It has a very low heel, which doesn't look bad at all. It absolutely is a fun fabulous boot and I am so happy that I invested in it because it has really solved its purpose Another love boot. As I said, the key is to start your year on the right foot so you won't get irritable and you won't get uncomfortable because comfort is key to feeling confidence and fabulous and to do your very best whenever you put your best foot forward, you definitely would do your very best. At least that's what I think because that 
what has worked for me over the years. And last year I invested in this pier as well and this is a pier that I love the chunkiness. I love the cutout details of this boot. Oh my god, it looks absolutely gorgeous. And again, comfort level is key. This is, uh, let me get rid of that. This is classic at, at its best. You can't go wrong with a boot, a boot like this. It would be around forever. And if it's comfortable, that's an added bonus. So this is definitely another pair that can help you start the year on your right foot. <laughs> this boot is, it's, it's, it's just something I couldn't pass up because it's one of those boots that you can just throw on and run out the door because it's so comfy. And what I did was to customize this a bit because um, I have very skinny ankles and, and calves. So I just ran the ribbon through it and so it's, it's, it stays up. In order for it to stay up, I ran the ribbon through it as a way to keeping it up. And I really like the way it turns out. I do those crazy things to customize my stuff, especially when I like something. So this is really, really, it's so comfortable. It's like you could just run and dance and walk and do anything in this boot. That's how comfortable it is. It's essentially the comfort level of this boot, why I bought it. And I also like, as I mentioned, the cute little details it had on it because it has those nice little holes in it that gives you a peak of skin as well. This would be great for somebody with thicker calves and who just love very conservative but at the same time a little bit of edge to it, to their look. And here you can see it a little bit better gorgeous it's without the ribbon here so it's perfect as well another great boot to start the 2018 year on the right foot guys let's do it <laughs> and of course I invested in some Michael Kors boots it's no it's not at all anything new for me to invest in boots because if I can wear boots all year round, that's what I would do. I found this fabulous pair on Nordstrom and I, I can't say anymore. Again, it has the gorgeous um, platform detail right there. It has an open toe, which means it transitioned well into summer, spring, autumn. So. I can wear this boot all year round. I know that the heel might look a little bit intimidating, but it's absolutely gorgeous. It's not only is it gorgeous, but it's comfortable. I wore this pair of boots at my country's gala and I danced in it all night and it wasn't at all bad. I danced in it all night and it was, it was great. It stood the test that night. So this is when I rocked it in the summer. And guys, I, I, I love this boot. It's, it's, it's a no, it was a no brainer for me. I just love it. It's, 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 oh, see, I'm speechless. I can't say anymore. It's a good looking boot. And the interesting thing about it is that you can wear this boot with dresses, with skinny jeans. It just looks so fabulous. And this is how I also paired it in the summer as well. And oh my God, it's so striking here. I love something. I like to invest in its pair. And I saw the green version my god guys isn't this color fabulous this is gorgeous 
unfortunately these were best sellers they sold out so quickly that when I went back to look at them again or to get a link I couldn't find them this love this boot I can't say anything else if you want to start your foot on the right foot these are the kinds of boots to definitely invest in and I haven't worn this one just yet but trust me it's gonna get it's 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 gonna be worn like crazy when it's a bit warmer <laughs> version of this one that's how much I love them because I invested in both and they were not as cheap as I expected them to be but so far I love them and will definitely give you some updates about them as I wear them more in the spring as well as the summer because yeah these are my summer boots and I love to rock boots in the summer as well so yeah <laughs> So let's start on the right foot with these guys. They are fabulous. Yes. Sadly, or should I say sadly, I've invested in a pair of Stuart Wiseman boots. I wanted to know what the hype was all about. And for me to, and there's, what else can I do but to invest in it? Trust me guys, if I don't like any of these boots, they are going back. It doesn't matter how long I've had them because I think Nordstrom has a policy where you can take your stuff back and you can, you may not get your money back, but you can definitely get a gift certificate or a store credit. So I invested in this boot and this was when it had the huge sale on I wanted the gray because I have many other over-the-knee boots that are not in gray so I definitely wanted this gray pair and I've tried it on and guys I do love it I haven't fully worn it yet, but I will definitely give you an update on this boot because I don't always believe what everybody says. I have to try stuff out for myself. So this is what I intend to do and I will definitely get back to you on it and let you know whether or not it is a great investment. But as I said, since so many YouTubers um, rave about how comfortable is, it is, comfort is key to me. So I wanted to definitely invest in it, not just because it's Stuart Wiseman, but because it's comfortable and it's classy and it's something that would be around for a long time.
this next boot I am not sure if it really needs any introduction but I bought this boot last in 20 in 2015 I think and it's one of my best purchases ever and I would tell anyone that if you're into thigh high boots and over the knee boots this is definitely one of the very first ones I would recommend reason being that it's at a great price point compared to the Stuart Weissman the comfort level is absolutely it's out of this world I cannot ask for more this is one of the gorgeous feature I just love about this boot this gorgeous gold detail that when you walk by you just get a hint and a glimpse of the gold especially in the night it's just absolutely stunning I just love this boot and the chunky heel means it's gonna last a long time you're not likely to replace this anytime soon and as I said comfort level is just out of this world it just blew the chart up love this boot forever <laughs> it's just absolutely fabulous and it's very high so in order to see it you definitely have to wear something shorter and um, definitely to show the boot off it's so gorgeous I just love this boot there's nothing else I can say and I didn't have a chance to grab it to show you during the introduction but definitely this is one that I could definitely not tell you about because it's great comfort level over the charts and look absolutely stunning and would be a piece to have in your wardrobe for decades to come as long as you don't feel shy about rocking thigh high boots when they are no longer trending. I'm not, so I'll definitely be rocking this bad boy for years to come. And those last ones I don't know how I could have missed really showing them to you because those ones I have had them in my wardrobe for over eight to ten years now and they have never disappoint I took them to my country St. Vincent and the Grenadines and any Vincentian out there watching this they know that we don't have like great roads in some areas where I'm from we don't have very great roads and I rock these boots <laughs> I just love them they are very comfy they are and they look so fab almost with anything you can wear them with a mini skirt a mini dress as well as your favorite pair of jeans skinny jeans and they just work fabulously with everything so I love them definitely is the type of boot that you can definitely have a lot of use for for 2018 if you see a style like this don't be scared to grab it it's gorgeous it's versatile and it's comfortable and you definitely look fabulous when you're wearing it must have to put 
put your best foot forward for 2018 and beyond. So that's it guys. That's my collection of boots that I am recommending that you look for whenever you're investing for 2018 and beyond. Guarantee that you're gonna love them for years to come. So there it is guys. Those are my tips on how to definitely start your year on the right foot when it comes to boots. Look for a platform, um, a boot or a shoe with platform that looks elegant and classy because some platforms, they're definitely, no, they're definitely not for the workplace or for certain environments. So, <laughs> and um, no shade to anybody, I'm just saying that some, not all platform shoes or boots are created equal. Some are shaped in ways that are not designed for certain work environments. But to each their own, if that's what you like, definitely for sure, go for it. And definitely test it out. If you don't like it, take it back. Who, who is going to sue you? It's your money. It's your investment. So do whatever you please. Other additional stuff that I wanted to mention to you guys is that over the years, so many people have been great and kind to me and it is something that I definitely want to pass along. Um, honorable mentions are friends like Marlena and Sam who have been extremely kind and sweet and generous to me ever since I became an immigrant, a newcomer to Canada. They have been absolutely uh, one of the best set of people I've ever met. So, my encouragement to anybody is to be kind to others, help where you can. And for me, I am definitely passing it on because what I'm doing and what I'm interested in doing and what I have done in the past is to definitely help new immigrants. I have helped in resume um, editing and in preparation interview preparation for job so it is definitely one of my passions because it's something i would definitely like to pass on and to share my experiences with others because i knew i know that coming to a new country is in itself a big challenge and one that not many people are courageous enough to undertake so I hope to continue to definitely help others in this area in any way I can. And I think my channel as well would definitely be a platform where I can share tips and tricks uh, on how to, to prepare for the workforce as well as how to dress because that is definitely key to you may not believe it but to get in a job. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you soon in the next one.